welcome to my channel. Today I have for you another kind of Christmassy video, which is my party dress collection. So I have seen so many YouTubers do this. I've seen Amelia Liana and I've seen from Victoria from In The Fro do it and I absolutely love watching these videos. Not only does it give me loads of ideas to kind of what things to go out and look for and buy and what to wear for the party season, but also ideas about how to kind of style it up and how different things look together. So I hope you enjoyed this video and before we go any further, please, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, I'll leave a subscription button on the screen somewhere now and also the button is below. I upload twice a week, so in order to not miss any videos, don't forget to subscribe and let's get straight in. Firstly, I have to say I want to apologise for the lighting. It is a dreadful day out there. It has been raining since this morning. I was so geared up to film and when I got up in the morning I was like, oh my god, I don't know how it's going to turn out because it was just so dark and dingy and rainy so I do apologise if the lighting isn't great but I would kind of set this day to film and I'd done all my makeup and everything and I was just like, ah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to film so I hope the lighting is fine and without further ado I want to get straight in into party dresses. So the first one is actually not a dress, it is a jumpsuit and it is this one from Claudie Pirlo. I know you probably can't see it very well given the way I've set up the camera, but I'm gonna insert cutaways of everything. So here it goes. So this is a beautiful jumpsuit. It has a lovely kind of detail on the shoulder, which is like a sort of a, a ribbon kind of a thing. And it's got like pleated material on the shoulder. It's a one shoulder jumpsuit. And then the, but it actually looks like a two piece. It looks like a top and uh, a pair of trousers. And the trousers are kind of, um, got pleats at the top and then the sort of more tailored and tapered at the bottom so I really love this jumpsuit I love jumpsuits because they're just so easy to throw on you don't really have to think of a top and a bottom you just kind of throw one thing on and when you want an alternative with trousers they are a really good option and for the winter especially I love them because you're so much more work than with your legs kind of bare and running around in cold London so I really like jumpsuits and this one is a favorite. My next one is a dress I bought when I was out on honeymoon and it is this beautiful number by Emilio Pucci. It was actually a store that we went to in Switzerland and they were having kind of super massive sales because they were going to shut the store down and they had amazing, amazing prices on everything. So I picked up this dress because I didn't really need a party dress when I went there, but my husband just was like, oh my god, you look so good and I just take it. And I love this aqua color. It is so beautiful and so, so flattering. And I feel like you can pull it off in winter and in summer. It's got kind of beautiful beading around the um, the kind of V cut at the front and also down the back. The back is absolutely stunning. It's not fully backless. It kind of just has an opening down the middle, but it looks so, so pretty. And I love the bell puffed up sleeves, which look so, so stylish and are so in. Um, it's just such a beautiful dress and it's kind of a satiny, silky material. So really nice and really wearable for all time of year. The next one is a dress I got from Carolina Herrera from their CH line and I purchased this this winter. It's a beautiful red dress. I've worn it so much. I've gotten so much wear out of this one because you can wear it to dinners, to parties. It's like the perfect kind of Christmas party dress. I love the red shade. I find it super flattering. Carolina Herrera does really beautiful reds. Like it's not too red, it's not too pink. It's just kind of the perfect, perfect shade. Flattering on all skin tones. And it has this sort of frill at the bottom. It's sort of an A-line dress, but then at the back, it's a little bit longer than at the front. And it has sort of this frill detail. And I absolutely love how that looks. It's so in right now. I first saw this dress on Olivia Palermo. She was wearing it on her Instagram, and I absolutely loved the way it looked. I think it looks so stylish, and the fact that it's not fitted means it's perfect for Christmas parties because you can eat as much as you want. So I really like it. And because it's sleeveless, you could actually layer it with something underneath if you want to make it more casual for day. So it's a really good one and you can also wear it with or without this kind of scarf that it comes with. It's in the same material as the dress and it's so beautiful. I love to kind of pin it up with a brooch like I've shown you in the cutaway. So a really good one for the party season. My next one is this one by Roland Moray. It is a classic kind of Roland Moray super 
fitted dress, like second skin type dress, but it's actually quite a thick material, which means that it doesn't show kind of any kind of bumps or lumps anywhere. It just hugs you in the right places. I love the one shoulder, and at the back, it's kind of, um, the shoulder strap is split into two, which I think is such a nice detail. The back is completely black, and then the front is in a navy blue with a sort of, um, kind of pearlescent uh, golden embroidery but it's not kind of glittery it's just kind of a little shimmery on the black background and then it has a little bit of blue as well it's just such a beautiful beautiful shade when the light hits it it just kind of shimmers but not in a glittery tacky kind of way so it's perfect for the party season when you wear it you just feel like a million dollars I just love Roland Moray dresses because they just give you that amazing amazing feeling because they just make you look so sexy and so glamorous and they really give you a great hourglass shape which I really need because I'm actually really small at my hips um, and I don't have much of a waistline so I feel like this dress sort of hugs me in at the waist and it makes my hips look a little bigger so I look like I have a little more shape in my body. I also love the exposed zip, a very Roland Moray kind of detail that runs um, down the side of the dress. So a really great one for any occasion that you may have. The next one is this one by Antonio Valenti. It's this beautiful nude dress. It's in a kind of really soft, thin, knitty kind of material, but it's still kind of nice enough that you can wear it to a party. It doesn't look kind of a chunky knit or anything. It's a very, very thin knit material, a very similar kind of material to the one that Alexander McQueen uses in their sort of bodycon dresses. So it's sort of a knit cum bodycon material. So it's really nice. I love the nude color. It's super flattering. I actually don't suit nude colors in dresses most of the time because they really wash me out but I feel like this one has a touch of pink in it and it just gives a little bit more glow to my skin and I feel like I can really pull it off. It's really fitted on the top and then it has a really full skirt at the bottom with sort of pleats but they're not really pleats it's just that this uh, it's got kind of a sheerer material in the middle, and then it's the um, same material as on the top, so it creates pleats with that. It gives it a lot of volume, it makes it really beautiful. I love that kind of sheer detail. It looks something really different, and it gives it a little more interest because it's all the same color, doesn't have any detailing, but that kind of little bit of see-through material makes it look really nice, but it's not that see-through that you can see your underwear or anything, so I really love this one, although it is kind of really fitted, so you do need something to kind of shape your body underneath. Body shaping underwear is really good with this one, so I really love this one, but it is a little bit more uncomfortable. Next um, one is one by Diane von Futzberg, and again, it's a red dress. It's a classic kind of um, shift dress. It's really nice. It's not bodycon, but it is quite fitted. I love the kind of detailing around the waist area. It's sort of kind of ruched and it just cinches you perfectly in at the waist. I love, love, love the pockets at the front of the dress. I love dresses with pockets. I, I just like them so much because sometimes you just don't know what to do with your hands and it's so nice and comfortable to be able to fit them into your pocket. You just look like you've got a good posture even though you're not really doing much and I really love them and this one's got like pockets at the front which are really nice and then it's sort of fitted down till the bottom. It's a very comfortable sort of stretchy material but still thick enough that it's not going to show kind of underwear lines or anything. So I really love this one and I feel like you can carry this one to the office but you can also dress it up for a night out so a really good one to invest in. Next up is another dress from Diane von Futzberg and it's this black dress. I picked this up maybe a couple of years ago but it's a really kind of staple little black dress. It's got straps and a sort of squarish neckline. It's got a round cutout back which is really really nice. I love the kind of low back detail. It's fully black but because it has lace over the whole dress it makes it a lot nicer and a lot more interesting. I love the lace detailing. I think it makes it look so sophisticated. Um, and it just has a great fit. It's really nice. Hugs you in the right places and at the back it sort of has a couple of pleats at the bottom which make it really nice because it just gives a little bit more something to the back of the dress because it's all kind of plain and black so that makes it a little bit more interesting. Next up is one I've had for a really long time which is from Mango and it is this pleated navy blue dress. Olivia Palermo actually wore this in like a Mango store opening or something and that's where I first saw it and I just fell in love with it. I think it looks so much more high end than it actually is. It has a lot of fabric and I feel that's what makes dresses look more expensive than they actually are. It makes it look really high quality. It's really nice, it's a kind of silky material, but then it's fully lined, which means it has quite a lot of volume. It's got a full A-line skirt, and um, it has sort of pleating all the way from the top to the bottom, 
Um, and then it has sort of satiny details in black on the shoulders and also black satin at the bottom, kind of creating a border to the end of the dress. So I really like this one. I find it super flattering. It's great for those days where you're a little bit bloated and you just want to kind of hide yourself a little bit, but it's still really flattering. And I love the kind of flirty A-line skirt. It makes it really nice and fun. And it comes with a beautiful beaded belt, which just gives it a little bit of sparkle and makes it perfect for a party. The belt also helps the dress cinch at the waist, which makes it gives you a much nicer figure. Just because it is kind of quite full on the top and full on the bottom, so it can look a little frumpy if there's nothing to cinch it in at the waist. My next dress is another black one, and this one is again from Claudie Piello, and I love this dress. I actually bought it at first, um, and I bought it for this party I had to go to, and I didn't end up wearing it for that. And I sort of kind of didn't like it for a while. I don't know why. I kind of fell in love with it at the store. Then I purchased it, and I sort of thought, mm, it's not that flattering. It doesn't look that good on me. But I shortened the hemline a little bit, and it just looked so much better, and I've really fallen in love with this dress. It's really nice. I, it's a... It's a sleeveless dress and it's got a beautiful mesh detail around the top. And it has these lovely tassels going down the front. I really like this. I think it gives it a really 1920s vibe. Makes it really interesting. And it's um, a really nice kind of mini black dress in a sort of creppy material which is really, really nice and super flattering. Again, a very easy silhouette to carry off. Um, good for kind of all shapes and sizes. And I really like this one. I've really, really loved this one ever since I shortened the hemline. I've worn it so much. And finally, I have saved the best for last. It is this dress that I bought recently in Dubai. It's the one I'm wearing right now. I don't know if you can see the top, but it is so beautiful, so stunning. It's from a designer called Julia Damani, and I bought it in Dubai. There's actually quite a long story behind this dress. I first went to Dubai in summer for uh, just on holiday. And I happened to see this in the Lafayette galleries in Dubai Mall. And I really loved it, but I thought, you know what, I don't have anywhere to wear this right now, so I don't think I want to take it. And then I had a wedding come up, um, also in Dubai, and I didn't actually have anything to wear for the reception. And I thought, oh, you know what, I'm just going to go check if they still have that outfit in Dubai. It was a big risk because I wasn't carrying anything else in case I didn't find the outfit. But thank God they still had it and they had it in my size. And it was just, it was one of those things that you see and you just love the first second you see it. And it's so beautiful. It's in a kind of neoprene material. It's really kind of flattering. I love the peplum top with the really kind of exaggerated peplum. I think it really kind of helps define my waistline and sort of makes my hips look a little bit bigger, which gives you a much nicer figure. I love the super fitted skirt. It's just so flattering. I feel like kind of Audrey Hepburn in Breakfast at Tiffany's. I don't know, it's just so stunning and it just makes you feel so beautiful. I love the look of it and it's just super, super flattering and I wore it to this wedding in October and I got so many compliments. By far, the outfit I've received most compliments in ever. I also really like the kind of um, belt detail with the ribbon and I love to add a brooch to the top just to add a little bit of interest just because it is quite plain. The off-shoulder top also is so flattering. I really like how it shows off your collarbones and it makes my shoulders look a little bit wider and they're actually really narrow so I feel like this adds a little bit of voice volume to my shoulders and it just gives me kind of a more balanced out body shape and it's just I love these kind of necklines I feel like they make you look so like kind of old school Hollywood glam I just it's just the most flattering dress I own and by far the one I've received most compliments in when I wear it so I absolutely love this one and that's it guys those were all my outfits I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it gave you some ideas of what to wear in the party season I hope you're enjoying these kind of more Christmassy and New Year's inspired videos with like tutorials and ideas for looks and hairstyles. I hope you've been enjoying them. Please do let me know what else you would like to see from me. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Facebook. I'll leave all my social media links on the screen now. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!